In this demonstration, we'll be looking at the configuration of Syntelex, which requires writing no actual code and can utilize machine learning if, if required. The configuration is general purpose and be, can, can be reused in multiple areas. It's not specific to a problem instance. Firstly, let's go and have a look at some data and see how we can utilize machine learning. Coming into this document and browsing through, we can see that an organization has been missed. The Guardian here has not been tagged as an organization. Now, in order to configure Syntelex to know that the Guardian is an organization and further enhance the out-of-the-box extraction, we click Markup. That takes us into the editing interface, and we see here we have a notification that machine learning is enabled. So, now, if I manually mark up the Guardian as an organization, Syntelex will automatically create the configuration that will always tag that as an organization moving forward, which we can explore now. Moving into the configuration, there are two main areas which we use to configure Syntelex, which are dictionaries and entity extraction scripts. If we drop into the dictionaries, we see that Syntelex has already created a learned dictionary letting us know that the Guardian is indeed an organization, which will be carried forward in future ingestion of data. If we desire, we can manually create our own configurations. For example, if I wanted to begin tagging weapons, I could say, uh, create a word list for weapons like so, and begin to populate it. There are lots of options in configuration to make this simplified and assist you. We can see this in action in the test environment within Syntelex itself. If I tap in AK-47 and submit, we see in the test environment here that AK-47 is now tagged as a weapon. Configuration of Syntelex can be this simple and easy. It gives another route in, on top of the machine learning option. Dictionaries are excellent for when you have a finite list of things you want to extract, such as weapons or groups. We also have scripts which allow us to look for a pattern for areas where you don't have a finite list. Moving on to the scripts and having a look at the manual creation of those, we'll use a number plate as an example in order to create a script. This is something that you wouldn't be able to have a dictionary for because there are endless possibilities. However, there is an underlying logical pattern. Without having wrote anything, if I save and test and then write an example of a UK number plate, I can then see currently this is not extracted. Here on the text graph, I can see all the different levels of markup going on behind the scenes in Syntelex. And at this level, the token level, I can see the pattern I require to extract. Two letters, two numbers, three letters. And by copy and pasting these into the scripting environment, I can build the script that I require to extract UK registration plates without any programming experience. Now, if we save and test this now, we see in the test environment that the registration is now extracted. Scripting allows you to do much more than this. You can add features, you can create links, you can create document tags. This is only the surface of configuration as well. N not just extraction, but everything that Syntelex does can be configured and tailored to an organization's needs without the requirement for any actual coding. Here we've shown how configuration is applied and the key is that it is generalized and multi-purpose. You can often reuse configuration in lots of different scenarios, making it a very efficient way of tailoring the system to your needs.